In this video, we will look at how to install the evaluation license and start an experiment in driverless AI. We assume that you have already installed driverless AI and have requested for and received an evaluation license key. So let's open a browser and paste the IP address or name of the machine that you have installed driverless on and give the port number 12345. And the first thing you're presented with is an evaluation agreement for driverless AI. And you can read this and we scroll down to the bottom. You have the option to agree to these terms. And then you're presented with the login screen. So at this point for demo purposes, you can enter any login or and password. And you come to the, the, the screen to start with. The first order of business is to enter the license key. You have to do this only once when you first install driverless. So this is where you go to your email where you receive the license key. At the bottom is your license key and you can cut and paste this entire text and paste it right over here. So and then when you click the save button, the license has been accept accepted and you're ready to start off your experiment. And now we want to add some data into our uh, driverless AI and then I click on over here and you get a couple of options. I click on file system and uh, I already have some data here and I can click on let's import the training data. I import file and I need to add the test data and I pick on test and I import this file here. So now that we have the data set here, you can also do some automatic visualization by clicking on this. And when you click on visualize, driverless AI will analyze your data set. And if there are some interesting features that it thinks that you should take a look at, it will present some visualizations uh, on that. This is useful to get an idea of how your data looks. Uh, data scientists like to do this. We then click on experiment and click on new experiment and we pick the data set that we want to run the experiment on. In this case, we use the training data set and it has read the data set about 24,000 rows and 25 columns. And the next step is to pick the target column, where, which is the column on which you want to predict. This example predicts uh, the default of uh, credit card payments. It predicts the probability that a user will default on a credit card payment based on historical payment information and some demographic information. So since we are picking this and there are some basic parameters that have been automatically set up, you click on launch experiment and that's it. So driverless AI has started off running an experiment for you. And just with a few clicks, you have been, you have started your very first experiment on driverless AI. You can look at the GPU usage and this machine uh, has one GPU and you see some of the GPU usage happening here. You see some of these bars and uh, the GPU gets utilized as the experiment proceeds. In this video, you have seen how to install an evaluation license key and start off an experiment with driverless AI. For more information, videos, and tutorials, please go to our website at docs.h2o.ai.